What is popping? Your homie is here to fulfill what y'all want me to do. All right? I ain't got no problem with that. I thought about it today, as most of us think about it too. I said, all right, let me go ahead on and do this. I told the cats I'm coming in. <laughs> I told the homies I'm coming in with the yeah, I mean, and uh, I'm going to give it to you. I think it's more than 25 in here, so two probably going to be honorable mentions, I think. I'll recount them before I get started. Anyway, yo, uh, FJ, I missed your video today, man. I was at work. I'm just getting off work, so uh, yeah, yeah, no doubt. So shout out to Marlon, Christian, FJ, uh, Nick Fan, pulling the strings in the house. Christian again, B Chosen's in the house, burn this in the crib, plus records, what's going on baby? Let me keep scrolling down, I see y'all been rippity rapping, Abraham AJ in the house, I just what's up, and we're going to go ahead and get started, uh, as I said, hit the likes, it helps the algorithm, and uh, subscribe and share, let's have some fun, alright, so y'all see I'm back in the lab, I was going to basically, um, all right. Oh, okay. We got Matt just came in, and we also have A to the Deuces in the house, all right? So right now, y'all listen to my second CD I've ever done called All in the Mind. I did this CD way back in 2001. So if y'all like my 2001 music, that's what you've been listening to. 2001, All in the Mind is not on the internet for you to get, but if you like it, I'll burn you a CD, I'll make an MP3, and you can pop it off and have it, all right? Let's get it started. Let me count one, how many I got here. Oh, before we can start, man, shoot. <laughs> I, worked, I worked a double bubble yesterday. Not only did I work a double bubble, I worked a, bu a, du a bubble and a half today. So your boy got to go ahead on and have a little something right here. A little, little uh, River Horse Oatmeal Stout from the company called, uh, what's the name of this company? I've got the name of the company. Anyway, River Horse Oatmeal Stout, because I like stouts. Also like, I like stouts, and I like uh, porters, man. I like porters, and I like stouts. Good vibes, baby, thank you, thank you. Y'all ready to go? Are y'all ready? Let's go. Toast. All right. You had to pass on Bay 19? Yeah, I feel you, man, it's all right. You know, it wasn't no, hey, Bay 19 was not a banger. It's not really a banger. Bay 19 was just, I wanted to get it because it first came out. I kind of wanted to be the first one to talk about it. But I like it. It's like a, a intimate type bedtime scent. Can't see myself wearing it out. The heat will blow it away and the winter will blow it away. All right, here we go. Let me take my camp. Is the music too loud? Is the music just right? Should I turn it down? Should I speak up? Should I adjust the camera? Y'all know I like being back here in the lab instead of being in the room. Now that's something just in the room, okay? I did not go, man, because uh, first of all, <laughs> uh, you know what? I don't like stepping on toes, man. You know, the reason sometimes, let me let me tell you, level good, cool. You know, you know what? Here, here's here's a quick here's a quick issue sometimes. Back in the day, I used to have sponsors, not sponsors. I used to have people, you know, give me a bottle or two from time to time. But I would speak my mind. So let's just say Shea and Blue sent me a bottle when Ud Ali first came out. They sent me a bottle, bada bada bomb. But then when they started checking out my video and my content, they stopped talking to me. Because I'll be keeping it real. I might like they juice, but that don't mean I can't speak the way I want to speak, man. I will not be censored. So I won't be censored for getting free bottles. I will not be censored because to get that, get this out, I don't care. I'm gonna speak my mind, and that's what it is. And I don't care if it's po political or the spiritual, whatever it is, I'm gonna speak my mind. So if y'all decide you don't wanna give me a bottle anymore, that's fine. Cause I don't sell out. You know your boy never sells out for bottles because the main thing is I don't love fragrances. And you know that. I don't love music. I don't love musical gear. I love nothing that's materialistic. That's all you need to know. Nautica Voyage, who is this cat? How you doing, Theodore? Hey, this good, brother. Perfect. Great scent. Nautica Voyage. Lovely. Okay, let's go. <laughs> I know, I know you messed around. All right, here we go. Let me count them first. 
I mean, so I kill them before I take them out of the yard, I mean. Man, let's see if I got them. They all stack them on top because I figured, let me just put them in the cooler so I can, you know, you know what I mean? You know what I mean? Let's see if we got them. Right. Yeah, if you have missed your live tonight, man, I want to check it out. I went on there, I'm like, I want to talk, I want to talk, I want to talk. I didn't realize that the live was over. <laughs> you think for somebody who do lives all the time, they know. <laughs> One, that's five over there in the chair. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12. 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 26. All right, so that means one of these will be an honorable mention. One will be an honorable mention. I don't know, let me look at the cage. I mean, well, let me look in a cooler and see which one it is. <laughs> yeah, they cold, Petey. They cold, baby. They cold, baby. No sip. Let's go. The honorable mention sauce in here. My honorable mention sauce will be a sauce that someone actually sent me this and I saw this tonight. I'm gonna re-up on this sauce. It's one point, the only thing about it is like 100 mil is like a, a buck something and 1.7 mil is like two something. Now make no sense. For another almost an ounce, you gotta pay almost another hundred dollars. So, but I got enough in here that I can just get me a mill and get me like a, 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 a one, what's that, 30 mil, and I'd be straight. And that is, somebody turned me on to this, man, I didn't know anything about it. Alessia, I'm a nomad. If you like Amber, now, if you like Amber, now, Alessia. I'm a nomad. Now, you know, 30 million one ounce is the same, of course. You know, I can add for a minute. Uh, 1.7 is like 200. 30 mil is like a buck something. But actually, somebody sent me this. Uh, I think I got a swap or something like that, man. When I smelled it, I'm like, yo! Oh, my man in North Carolina, he was a writer. He turned me on to this in a company called Gree Gree. And man, this right here. Now, I like a lot of ambers. I started out being an amber head. When I first started, I was an amber head. Cause that was a safe note for me. Amber, 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 uh, amber, amber. Everything was amber when I first started into this game. Amber, the amber, the amber, the, and it started with that Prada having amber in it. So I guess the Prada rolled me into amber. This is good. This is good. Only I can't put it in the list because I don't even wish for it that much. Because sometimes I forget I have it. But Alicia, L E L I S I R E. Lissier, Amber Nomad. This stuff is really, really good. Nice deep amber. Do you see it got the amber color? I'm not gonna get in the notes because some of these I don't know what the notes are. All I know is I like it, you need to buy it. Lissier, Amber Nomad. And like I said, I still have, but I'm not gonna say this is the best I have. This is one of the best I have in my cage. I wanna get the Ronnie and Jay. I gotta get the I gotta get that Ronnie and Jay one day, man. I gotta, I gotta, you know what? A lot of people have a list. I know, I know, man. Well, no, there's 14 likes. We got 14 likes now. We starting to kick it. Um, I gotta start having my list. I gotta start writing down my list. Cause sometimes I'll get, I'm old, man. I forget stuff. I'll be like, dang. I haven't bought Cure Valores yet. I'll be right back.
there will be two honorable mentions. How did I forget that piece, man? How did I forget that piece? Because I, I really wasn't seeing it. I really didn't see it. Ronnie J is out there been wanting to get to. Yeah, man, Ronnie and J, I know I want to get into the Amber. I got to have an Amber rock by Ronnie and J because somebody sent me a sample. And man, that thing smells good. Oh, Galan's a good house too. But you know what? Galan, Galan is starting to be too mainstream for me. I'm, you know, I got in the niche and then I started getting in the mainstream niche because I want to be safe with everybody else. I want to. I kind of wanted to get what everybody else like, you know what I mean? So I started off with a whole bunch of Tom Fords and all that stuff. Kind of everybody else like Tom Fords. But now I'm not in the mainstream niche. I'm like trying to get out of the mainstream niche like a lot of people are. What's the name of this song? Um, I forgot the name of the song. Oh, it's All in the Mind. The name of that song is All in the Mind. I be getting... I made this song, I made that CD in 2001, man, so I forgot, but thank you for asking. All in the Mind, one of my favorite songs on the CD. All right, so Alicia Yair, and the number two honorable mention, number two honorable mention, a lot of you cats might say, well, yo, that's crazy. And read this honorable mention, because you can't wear this every day, but it is super special, super, super special, but you can't wear it every day, but it's super special, honorable mention, Fusion. Sacri by Maja Bakali. You can't wear this. It's vegetal, it's sweet, it's vanilla, it's, it's, it's ve vegetal vanilla. Yo, this bad boy right here, this is crazy. I love my baby, I've changed on my. <laughs> Thank you, brother. Thank you. I appreciate it. I appreciate it. Yes. And this is, again, this is another work of art. This is a work of art. See, not everything I have are like crowd pleasers. I like works of art too. I like stuff that's like, man, I probably would never wear this, but it is a work of art. Now I wear, of course I wear Fusion Sakri, but you can't wear Fusion Sakri all the time. And you can't wear it out on like a date night. <laughs> it ain't gonna work. But if you wanna wear this to work, just to twist people's nose, I like to twist people's noses, man. You know what I mean, in a favorable way, in a favorable way. That's right, this one got the, the celery in it. Absolutely. And some other kamquats and all kinds of stuff. You know what I mean? Crazy. Fusion Sacre. Second album mention. Now let's start. And again, these will not be in order. Will not be no order. Aoud Muhammad by Private Distillery. Right on, right on. I don't know why you say in your opinion. Why you always say in your opinion? First of all, you're the only one that have it. So you ain't got to worry about nobody saying, nah, man, I don't think so. I don't think Ahu Muhammad is smells like that. You don't, have to, you don't have to worry about anybody ever saying to you, Christian, nah, man, ain't no way that smells like that. Because you're the only one that got that juice, bro. It, it, in my opinion. Dog, you are the opinion. You, know, you ain't got to worry about it. You are the opinion. If you say it smells like that, I believe you. <laughs> are you kidding me? You are the opinion, bro. My man, no doubt about it. Pots and pans. Know what I mean? All right, let's go. Number 25. I know it's a favorite of you guys. Everybody like this. Everybody likes this. And I'll go ahead on because it's kind of the tallest thing that's in the cooler that came out the cage. And of course, it's got to be Kalamot. Not Kalamot Black. You got to wait, PTS. You got to wait. You got to wait, bro. You gotta go out the way. Kalamot. And of course, who broke Kalamot? Who broke Kalamot to the world? Who made Kalamot what it is today? Even Kalamot Black. Who made Kalamot what it is? I'm not here to brag, but I wanna know who made Kalamot what it is. Thank you, my brother. Thank you. I bought this bad boy. I went down to Virginia to Perfumes to France one summer, went down there. Sammy was down there. Sammy said, uh, I got something I think I want you to smell. Now, Sammy is from, Sammy is from overseas. I'm not sure where at, Saudi Arabia, whatever. But he's from over there. So he said, I want you to smell something. Smell it. And I smelled this. I'm like, oh, smiggity, smaggity, slippity slap. What? What? Oh, and it was over. I came back and told everybody about it. Next thing you know, I called Sammy. I was like, Sammy, do you have any more? He was like, they're gone. He's like, honestly, he was like, yo, after you put the video up, 
Muggs was calling like crazy. Dried him out. I think he only had like maybe five or six anyway. Dried him out. The wait on Kalamat back then was like probably like two months. He had the wait. He was like, I got the wait. So you had to get it from, um, I forgot the name of the perfume house over in the a, uh, a, uh, UAE. What's the name of that house over there? They did do a lot of uh, importing. But anyway, you had to get it from them. Universal Perfumes. You had to get it from Universal Perfumes, and it still was like a three-week wait to get that. I know they don't give me no credit, brother, but as long as y'all know, and sometimes I got to remind you, as long as y'all know, y'all know. The best five all the time, I might do that another time, bro. I might do. But see, that's going to be speculative again, because that's the best five all the time in my cave. I smell some really good fragrances that are not my cage that I just can't afford to buy. So when I say top five all the time, it's kind of speculative if we're saying in my cage. No, it would got to be top five all the time that I ever smelled in my life. And I smelled, and I'm talking about in the store, smelled over probably about a thousand fragrances. And I ain't talking about samples. I'm talking about I've been in the store and I smelled about a thousand fragrances being all the places I've done Cause I like go to the store and smell my juice, you know what I mean? So, um, yeah, for me, that's what it is, baby. That's what it is. So here we go, Kalamai, number 25. Put that on the mixer right there. Number 24. Actually, I am gonna save, I am gonna save my last five for the ones I really, really like, okay? I'm gonna save the fast five for the one I really, really, really like. You like real juice, not? <laughs> I'm drinking, I'm drinking the office juice now. Mm. This tastes just like the office by Jeremy Faragorance. Jeremy Faragorance, the fragrance god. The Faragorance god. Cool. Y'all know what it is. One, two, three. What is it? Y'all know what it is. What is it? And after you tell me what it is, who turned you on to this? And who turned you on to Lubin the Cod? Come on, come on. Who turned you on to Lubin the Cod? Come on, come on. Yeah, I did, yeah, I did, yeah, I, did. Yeah, I, did. Yeah, I, did. Yeah, I turned you on to Yes, cause, <laughs> yeah man, cause I got into Lubin long time ago. Like Lubin, when I was going to Mid New York a lot, when I went to New York, and I was doing Mid New York, they had the they had the whole entire uh, Lubin line, and the first one I ever bought was Lubin Idol, and I was I was about to walk out. In fact, I was walking out the store. I remember, I remember, it. and there's a guy there by the name of Christian. Christian was working there. Actually, it was two Christians. There was a young lady named Christian and a guy named Christian, and he always suggested juice for me. There's another one that he suggested too, and he was like, smell this. And I saw it, and I looked at the bottle, and man, that bottle, I said, even if it stink, that bottle was hot. All right, our dial is a black bottle with a, a dark brown top. So I said, we smell it. And when you smell, hear this guy, hear this guy. This guy knows too much. You look at too many of my videos, man. Lumen, up at Tim is the only one I don't like, bro. I must say, that's the only one I don't have. And I could have bought Lumen, I could have bought that a long time ago. Never, never, never got into it. But anyway, uh, yeah, a cod, a cod, a cod. I like the other ones too. I like the other offerings too. But this one right here, best juice is pure malt by Muggler. Hey man, pure malt. I like pure vine. Pure vine is my favorite. Then pure malt when it comes to his line. All right. Hey, oh, there, there he go, man. Lumina cod, number twenty-four. Number twenty-three. Now this one right here, everybody should already be wearing. You got to be wearing this. There's no way you're not wearing this. Oud Cafe by Mancera. You know how, you do you know, I do not agree that nachos are better than Pure Havana. Nachos are just as good as Pure Havana and just as good as nachos. I had nachos for two weeks and I sold it. That's what I thought about nachos. Anyway, Oud Cafe. Ooh Cafe. Ooh Cafe. Now, if you don't have Ooh Cafe, I don't know what you're waiting for. I don't know what you're waiting for. 
Nope, different notes. What has what has kind of the same in my in my opinion, CO, Cafe Intense is similar to um Cafe Intense is similar to Roses Vanille. If you smell Roses Vanille and Cafe Intense or Intense Cafe, because I have both, they are close. I think when he left Montal to go to Mancera and start the Mancera line, he took some of them juices and he took them bad boys over to Mancera. Cause I'm telling you, Rosa Vini and freaking Intense Cafe, they sound the same to me. Yeah, I did break Rosa. Yeah, I broke Rosa too. I got I forgot where I get Rosa from. Rosa is nice too. Rosa is very, very, very close. Rosa is very close to um to uh, Kalamot. Rosa was very close to Kalamot. Absolutely. So, 23 Ood Cafe. Ood Cafe. Uh, which one does that? Rise. Throwing in some cash rent. Now, no, I ain't feeling like that. I like all the moves. I, I like, I like, I like velvet mood. I like cashmere mood. I like, uh, I like all the moves in the Uber. I like them, but after a while, other stuff just came out, man, and just kind of encapsulated. Only one I like from MLK now is Ood X Street. That's the only one I want. Ood X Street. I don't care about it. nothing else MFK had. Ood X Street. That's all I'm getting. Oh yeah, Corgan is good. Yeah, Corgan is good too. It smells like vanilla, but there's no vanilla in it. Unbelievable. Even the bottle makes you think there's vanilla in it because the bottle is white. But there's no vanilla in it. There's no cream in it, nothing. But it gives you that kind of, yeah, it smells like vanilla. But it's not, to me. Ooh Cafe, buy it. 22. 22. Of course, of course, of course. The original Oud Bouquet. Not the Oud Bouquet that they have now in Nordstrom's. Not the Oud Bouquet that they have now in Neiman's. The original Oud Bouquet. And don't forget about Latre Oud. Latre Oud is good as well. Latre Oud is really good. Really, really stinky Oud. So if you want Oud, stinky Oud, get Lancome. And this is Maison Lancome. This is not the regular Lancome that make you know, makeup and all that stuff. This is Maison, yeah, Lancome. And this is the original bottle. So if you're gonna buy it, they got the new ones in there. But if you want the original, y'all see the juice jumping around, cause I don't play around. Get the original. That's right. Vintage, Oud Bouquet. 21. Gotta do like E-Dot. E-Dot is one of the best reviewers ever, man. I learned a lot from E-Dot, but I just don't have the patience. I started out doing editing and stuff like that. But look at the E-Dot videos over the last couple days, man. E-Dot is the man, man. E-Dot is the man. That's why he's my sensei. E-Dot taught me everything I know about the juice fragrance game. E-Dot, Eric Hill, Centrifugal Force. That's why I am where I am today. All right, you got it? I know you got leather oud in your top 25. Here he go. Here he go. Here he go. Here he go. You know what I mean? Oud bouquet by Maison Lancome. Number 21. He's a Mancera and a Montal and a, and a Perfume Aroma and an Amwaj and everything master. Next. Coming out of the house of, oh yeah, but well, they're my two boys right there. We came up together. Zayas, I bought stuff for Zayas. Zayas, burn me on the stuff, man. We, it's my boy, Zayas. Now let's go. Next. Yes, the Cherry Bomb. The Cherry Bomb H001. If you don't have House of Cedars 01, you ain't got nothing in your collection. You know why? Because nothing in your collection does this. Bam, James Bond. Oh, man. I'm going to do it again just in case you didn't see it. You ready? James Bond. Oh, you got to have your James Bond juice, baby. You got to have cherry, woods, vanilla, but more cherry, woods, and African strawberries. I don't know what's in it. It's cherry, and the ladies dig it, and that's why I wear the juice. Number 21, HSO 011. Next, number 20, right? Two honorable mentions. 25 from 12, 23, 22, 21, number 20. Here we go. 
Like I'm trying to make sure I say my. Here's one that my man Christian gifted me. And I really like this. I will put this. I would have put this in my top 10, but I haven't worn it enough to really have enough experience with it. But I know when I wore this, this skanky stanky oud piece cleaned up. Like, you know, you see a dude always looking raggedy and all of a sudden he put on a tux and a ball like he tucked and he tight and he banging. He like, you know, North Philly hood, super style. That's what this is. Bam. Went in gold one. This bad boy right here, you start off with the skanky stank. Skankity stankity. The skanky stank. The skanky stank. I mean, it's a little bit sweet, but you still get the skanky stank. I can smell it in the background. Skanky stanky. So what happens is you can smell the sweetness from the nozzle and you spray it on and you smell the skanky stank. The smell, you gotta smell it. I'm trying to find a freaking nozzle, yo. Why can't I see the nozzle? Where's the nozzle at? Christian, where's the nozzle on this? Oh, there it is. Woo! Oh! Oh, goodness. Skankity, stankity, stank. Please dry down soon. Please dry down, Mr. Stankity Skank. No, it's not musty stank. No, it's sweet. It's like, this must be like, is this Cambodian oud or is this, uh, is this Indian oud? Because it's stanky, but it's not super stanky. It's not stanky like, if you ever smell uh, um, Najaf, or Zanzibar now by... Zanzibar and the Jaff by Jim Joff. If you ever smell that, that's barnyard, stinky cow, scout, car, cow fart. Ooh. Zanzibar is crazy, dog. Is it Indonesian? Ooh, yes. Yeah. Yeah, man. Yeah. It's not, it's not, oh, it's not overly stupid, super skank. But then if I put this on and went to karaoke night, and the ladies was like, oh, you smell so good. Zanzibar is a bad boy. Zanzibar is a bad boy. But the thing about the Zanzibar, just like with the witty end, the, the, it dries down to this beautiful vanilla. Beautiful vanilla, man. It's like, how can something that stinky in the beginning after seven hours, because that's how long it's going to pretty much take for that to get down to that vanilla. Something that long, because it stinks that long, dries down to a freaking vanilla. Unbelievable. Oh, yo, man, catch a replay. Good seeing you, BC. My man, be chosen, leaving. Holla at your boy. That what it is? Good. Very good. That's number 20. Number 19. Another one, but it doesn't have oud in it. But it's called oud. It's called by a different house. Oud for love. I grabbed this from Parfums of France as well in Virginia. Man, the ladies just can't get enough of this bad boy right here. Ooh for love. And it smells better when you shake it. Oh, so good. So, 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 so good. Ooh for love, number 19 by a different company. Man, this is bada bing, bada bing, bada boom, bada bing, bada boom. Bada bing, bada boom. But there's no oud in it. There, there's not enough oud. I don't, I don't smell any oud. But this is just beautiful. You get like this. It's like it smells like suede. It smells like a brand new Prada jacket. If you ever had a Prada jacket, cause I got one. Like, it kind of smells like a Prada jacket. No, it's not going on. Mm -mm. It's not going on. It smells like leather. I don't think there's any leather in here, but it smells like suede. Suede or leather. It's like the inside of my Prada jacket. That's what it smells like. My, 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 my three limp, my three quarter limp. That's I'm spraying inside of it. <laughs> I'm just kidding. It don't smell like a spotted jacket. It don't. But it smells kind of leathery. It says oud for love. I don't think there's any oud in it, but it smells so good. So good. Definitely, if you can get it at a good price, buy it. 210 for 50 mil is a little bit too much. Anywhere around between 125 and 150, I would buy it. Buy it. All right. 18. As E dot would have in this video. 18. Number 18. 
from my girl, from my girl, number 18, rhubarb and custard from 4160 Tuesdays, London. Unbelievable. When I smell this, I'm like, and I have, like I said, I have 12 of her bottles. Man. The thing about the rhubarb and custard is when you put it on, it's like, it's like, it's like two cousins fighting. It's not like a brother and sister or two brothers or two sisters fighting. It's like a cousin, two cousins fight. Because you smell the rhubarb, it's bitter. But you smell the sweetness. It's, it's exactly what it says. Rhubarb and custard. You smell rhubarb and you smell custard. And that's it. Ain't that, it's not changing. It's total linear. It's what it is straight from the door. That's what it is. Rhubarb and custard by 4162's East London. You got to get it. Mm. Oh, man. I mean, like I said, yeah, like bittersweet. Yeah, like bittersweet, man. But bittersweet and yummy. Yummy. I mean, you know, rhubarb is like a, a vegetable, right? I don't know. Rhubarb is a fruit or a vegetable. Whatever it is. Put some whipped cream on it and eat it. Rhubarb and custard, 4162's East London. Number 17. Number 17. One that I really want to get back. All right, my brother, talk to you soon. You get the replay. I'm going to check out your replay too on the, uh, on the, um, I forgot you was doing. You, you just, you did the live. I'm going to check out your replay on the live as well. Talk to you soon, brother man. Bullion. Bullion by Barredo. You talking about a really nice plum? This is a nice smoky plum. It's not like the plum by, and I'm gonna tell y'all, I'm gonna tell y'all, I'm gonna tell y'all. It's a smoky plum. It's not like the plum in Andy Warhol. It's not like the plum in, um, it's not like the plum in Bond number nine, uh, uh, the joint that replaced Warhol. It's not like the plum in Single Malt. It's not like the plum and project, uh, 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 plum Japanese. It's not like the plum and um and um, um, um dark rum. This is a smoky plum. I cannot get enough of smoky plum. And you see, I got that much left because I'm, I'm scared to spray it. Because I do not want to have to buy this again. Because if I buy it, I'm going to have to pay the whole boat for the 100 mil, $260. Because I got to have this whole job in. Every time I go at the Rogers store, I've been trying to get him to give me a discount. I'm like, Rod, you still got that bullion? Yeah, I got that bullion. How much? Nah, too much. Can't get it. So when I come home, I can't spray it. But I can smell the nozzle. Yes. Oh, and it's not like, no, Brook the Zoo is a different plum as well. That's a different plum as well. Now, let me give y'all a caveat that I want to make sure y'all don't, y'all don't forget. There's no Suspiros in this count, I mean, in this in this topic. And there's no Killians. Why? Because I was too lazy to get them. Because there's up in the top of the cage. There's no eggs. So there's no Killians, there's no eggs, and there's no Suspiros, because I ain't feel like getting them out the top of the cage. But I do like them too. But we're gonna stick to these, all right? They'll be a part of my top 10 super special fragrances. Number 17. 17, 17, 17, 17, 17. Number 17. Nah, man, nah, nah, 17 is not it. Clive Christian's E. What we have in Clive Christian E, we have rum, maple syrup, can't spray this, can't be spraying this like I'm crazy. <laughs> can't be spraying this like I'm crazy. Rum, maple syrup. I've got the other note. And light clove. It's called sweet clove. Yes, rum and maple syrup, man. With the sweet clove. It says sweet clove. Gourmand sweet clove. Because it is a gourmand. It is edible. This is what you want to eat. Rum. Oh. Maple syrup on top of your pancakes. Clove as a little spice. And I forgot the other note. Number 16. Cloud Christian E. Next. Number 15. 
I got a feeling the countdown has been skewed, but we're gonna keep on going. Number 15. It's kind of tough, but we gotta call it. Andy Tower, Un Chapre Rose. One of the creamiest roses I ever smelled in my life. So creamy, so sweet, so effervescent. When I wear this, man, oh, oh, they go crazy when I wear this joint. And it kind of reminds me of Incense Rose. You know what I mean? Kind of reminds me of Incense Rose. Yeah, it is the great, you're right about that. The great, great grandfather of New Harlem. You're right about that. Indeed. But yeah, man, this right here, Un Chapre Rose. And the other one good too, the other rose fragrance is good, which is the Candle Heart Rose. Candle Heart Rose, Un Chapre Rose, and Incense Rose. So Candle Heart Rose meant Un, Candle Heart Rose meant Incense Rose, and this one came up. Un Chapre Rose, buy it. Number 15. Number 14. Kind of hard to say this one. This is, a, this is a tough go. This is a tough go. And you can't find this anymore. And I like juices that you can't find anymore. And then y'all gonna go and try to find it. But you can't find this anymore. And the name of this juice is from the house of R. D. Parfum. What's the name of this house, man? My man turned me on to this house. I cannot read the lettering of this house. All right, it's Firenze something, something Firenze. So it's an Italian house. But if you can find this, and if you find this, you find two bottles, please let me know if you find this, because I got to have this. One of the unbelievable, complicated gourmands I've ever smelled in my life. And I smelled a lot of juices. But to have a gourmand that's crazy, now nah, West Side, West Side is nice too. But it's like a generic type thing. Bond number nine is generic to me, man. I mean, this is mainstream generic. I don't really get down with Bond number nine like that, man. I see, every time I go to Bloomingdale's, I smell the whole line. Just remind myself of how I don't get down with Bond number nine. Too many juices, too many concoctions that they just twisted together and blended and made a juice. Now we ain't doing that. The name of this juice is called Sagami. Look how much I got left. Sagami. Just look it up. I, I, I Look up Sagami. This thing was such a surprise. I bought this from Men, New York. And man, I didn't know what I was getting myself into. I just bought it. And I'm like, well, let me just check it out. And when I first sprayed it, I'm like, ah, uh, I ain't really dig it. But then it started to dry down. Oh, this is just so delicious. So delicious. You get the booze. You get the sweetness. You get, you get the light floral. But for the most part, man, look, man. You know, there's no bonds in my joint, and there's no definitely no creeds in my no. This is so amazing. I'm sorry, man. I'm almost. I kind of want to call this almost like a masterpiece. Almost. This is just bananas. Oh. I just can't describe this except that you smell the booze. I don't know if it's whiskey. I'm not sure what's in this. I just know I need to find this. If y'all find this and find two bottles of Sagami, please, 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 man, I'll pay you the extra dough to pick it up for me. Because I can't, I can't find it. I can't find it overseas. I can't find it nowhere. I think the house is Perfumum del Forenzi. I think that's the house. Sagami, man. Oh, it's so good. And I know it's number 14, but still, it is very good. It's just different, man. I might wear this tomorrow. No, this is one of the juices I can only wear special occasions. Because I only got that much, and they don't make it no more. That's another thing. I like to buy juices they don't make anymore. And you can't find anymore, or it's going to take you forever to find. I try to buy those juices as well. You know what I mean? No doubt about it. I know, man, but you know I'm careful about saying that. I'm very careful about saying masterpiece. I'm very careful with my words, man. Because I don't play that game, man. I don't play that frag Luminati, smell Luminati game. Calling everything a masterpiece. Everything can't be a masterpiece. And you can't love everything. Let's go. Next. Number 13, I think. 
Number 13. This is hard to say, but I got to say it. Mom luck. Now actually, mom luck and owl cot is a tie, but I figured I go with mom luck a little bit more because I like what's going on in mom luck. I like what's going on in mom luck. Honey, it's crazy. Oh. Mm -mm -mm. Mm. Thick, rich, gluey, ooty honey. Just, just gonna glue to your skin. What you spray on your skin is gonna stay glued to your skin. And I like to thank, again, I like to thank my man Christian for uh, revamping my mom luck because I was down to the low in the mom luck. You know what I mean? That's crazy. I was down to the, yeah, I mean. But yup, mom luck. Number 13. And thank you, Christian. All right. See how many I got left. Make sure I got the count. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Yup. I'm down to the last 12. At this point, I'm going to start ranking the ones I really like. Okay. I'm going to start ranking them. So let's go. At number 12. And y'all might have saw Miss Ava. This one I turned Miss Ava on to. And I turned, I kind of turned the world on in this one too. A lot of people wasn't even smelling this. A lot of people ain't seen no people talking about this juice because a lot of people don't really know about this house. But that's what it is. I'm not a mainstream house guy. I'm all over the place. I picked this up from Barney's. I heard about this house a long time ago when I got into the game. And I they was talking about Paris uh, in LA. They was talking about uh, a couple other ones. But this one right here, and your girl, Ava. Messy, sexy, just rolled out of bed. Yeah, man. Yeah, yeah. And as she she was kind of trying to say, yo, he got to stop bundle spraying. That will never happen. Never. So here we go. This smells like exactly what it's supposed to smell like. Messy, sexy, just got out of bed. She was trying to describe what it was. She was trying to get sexual with it. I got sexual with it a long time ago when I bought it. It smells like you and your girl got busy, y'all finished the act, you got stuff all over the sheets, it's messy, the sheets are messy with all kinds of freaking fluids, and then you still smell the perfume from her, and you smell the sheets, all that. That's what this is. It's sex in a bottle. It's after you have sex. Messy sexy just rolled out of bed after you have sex. That is it. That's what this is. After you have sex. Buy it. Uh, nope, not doing it. I don't care. I don't care. I'm spraying how I want to spray. I'm not wearing it in the wintertime. I don't care about summertime. All I got to do is say, bundle spray leather. Oh, no, we're not doing that. That's why I don't have leather oud. Exactly why I don't have it. That's right. And who made this right here? Dominic Ropien. Dominic Ropien is my boy. Dominic Ropien is going to make my juice. And if I had, if I still had soul, my custom national, because Dominic Ropien made custom national too. And who's calling me? Uh, no. Custom national, Dominic Ropien made that too. Holla at your boy. Bada bing, bada boom. Messy, sexy, just got out of bed. If you like having sex and smelling like sex, but you don't have sex, you're not getting none, spray this on you and people will think you had sex. That's all I got for you. Number 11, dog going in. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. Next up is the juice that I wore to my Grammys. What's going on, Bronze Age? Don't forget, all you guys who are new here, check me out. Like, subscribe, and share. I might have 2,000 subscribers by the time this video is over, maybe, huh? You never know. I've been doing this for six years, and I never hit 2,000 subscribers. You know why? Because I only cater to a certain amount of people. I don't sell out. I don't do top tens because I only do that. That's all I need to do is that. I want my crowd to be like that. It's like I don't need 100 friends. All I need is two friends. I don't need 10,000 subscribers to my channel because I know 10,000 subscribers ain't looking at me every time I do a video. No. I need just enough to know you're going to come. And here you go, baby. You know what it is. The Grammy juice. Omni Perfume Madeira. I wore this to the Grammys. And do I need to show y'all my pictures of all the women 
that I took pictures with at the Grammy. Do y'all need to see no pictures? You can see them. Let's go to my website, www.rajur.net. Yeah, your boy got a website. I don't play around. Go to my website and check out Grammy pictures. This is what I wore the night of the Grammys. And look at how many females is all on top of me. Oh, what? What? Play yourself. Number 11. I miss you. I miss you so much. I'm not going to wait until I go to the next Grammys in 2021, baby. When we win the next Grammy. You know what I mean? In fact, what I'm going to do is, since I wore it to the Grammys, I'm going to spray it on my Grammy imitation. So I can always remember that I wore this to the Grammys. Oh, so sweet, so nutty. Another boozy fragrance. Oh, so cute and pretty. Cute, pretty. Cute, pretty, awesome. See if you can find it, if you can. Ha <laughs> ha! If you can, you can, you're gonna be able to find it like that. Mm. eBay, you're gonna find it on eBay, forget it. Nope, don't even try it. You're not gonna find Sagami on eBay. If you do, it's going to cost you $1,000. My Grammy Juice Omni Perfumi Madeira. Word to the Grammys. A Grammy invitation for that year. All right, here we go. Next. Next. Where's the top at, dog? Why do it at the top, dog? Freaking top. Here's the top right here, man. Can't you see? Oh, stuff back here, man. Sometimes. I got your Roger Dove right here. Roger Dove River Horse Oatmeal Milk Stout by Roger Dove. There's only Roger Dove you're going to spend on my collection. I would not spend that kind of money on no juice. That's never going to happen. Ever. Let me bottles of quality juice I can buy instead of trying to brag I got a Roger. Look what I got. I got a Roger. Yeah, but you have to sell 17 bottles to get it, fool. Playing. Roger don't get no crap. That's why Roger don't like me like that. Roger ain't gonna mess with me. Roger ain't gonna holler at me. I don't want it. I don't want it. All right, girl, you can send it to me, but I don't really want it, but I'll take it. Yeah, I'll always take what you send me. Anyway, number nine. I mean, sorry, number 10. All right, here we go. The top 10. You back up there already? The top 10, baby. Are y'all ready for the top 10? Well, I got to turn some more music on for the top 10. In fact, for the top 10, we're going to play them 2020 tracks. Here we go. For the top 10, we're playing tracks from the 2020 CD. So let's go. All right. And if y'all want me to make some music, y'all want me to make y'all some music uh, 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 for, your, for your videos, FJ, you need some music, man, let me know. I make you some music, bro. And you can play your own original music. I'm not sure what you be playing in the beginning of your drink, man. But I don't think the honeys like that music, dog. You gotta, you gotta, you gotta, you gotta put some nice smooth music for the ladies and bring them in, baby. The girl used to love. Hit me up, baby. I make you a track, MP3 it to you. Bada bing, bada boom. I will call you on the phone. We can be rapping. Y'all, man, I don't like that. Nah, dog. Put a little bit more bass in that joint. No, make that pop like that. You know what I mean? It'll be your special track. You can say something over the phone. I record it and put it in the track. That's what I do, dog. I'm a producer. That's what I do. All right, let's go. Top 10. Number 10. Number 10. We got to go with Youth Memories by the Fragrance Kitchen. Uh, Nope, you're not going to be able to find it because you can't get it. Your boy, get the juice. Oh, man. Another one I wore to open mic night. And they were, what are you wearing? What are you wearing? Youth memory. Oh, okay. They didn't know what it was. Youth memory. That's what. Come here. Come here. Let me smell you. Oh, that is good. That is good. Ain't it, Juanita? Yeah, that is good, girl. Yeah, you got it. You picked it up. Well, you lucky. You, you lucky. You got it, bro. You lucky. Youth memories by the Fragrance Kitchen. Man, this is so good. It's not overcloyingly sweet. It's not super sweet. Actually, it got like a like a rose. It's like a floral sweetness, but it's more sweet than floral. And that's why the ladies take to it, because they smell a little bit of floral in it. But that freaking, that sweetness in it. Buy it if you can find it. 
Youth Memory by The Fragrance Kitchen. That's my E dot. Number nine. Number nine. I know a lot of people say, yo, how can that be your number nine, Raj? You always talk about it. You always say how much you like it. But it's your number nine. I know. But compared to what I have here in this guy, I mean, it's number nine. And that is going to be, I just acquired it. Paulo Santo. Just got my collection. Just got this collection, what, two weeks ago? Two weeks ago, just got this in the collection. It's number nine. That says a lot that this stepped over all these juices. Even H001. Even. Buy it. I know you did. I saw you. I saw you review it. Buy it. You got to get it. And I got three more Corner Barcelonas coming in this week. Oh! And we'll be done with the Corner of Corner Barcelona line. I wasn't down with the D16. I wasn't really down with the Elborn. Elborn is cool, but I smell better vanillas. You know what I mean? But the other three I got coming in, no, at least two of them. Two I got coming in, y'all gonna be like, yo! Yo, dog! Yo! And that's what I said. And I never smelt it. But when I read the notes, I'm like, Oh yeah, I gotta get these two because they have my main note in there. Oh yeah, no doubt. Yeah, I can't tell you. You got your wood. You got your semi-sweet. You already know what they are. <laughs> you got your semi-sweet and you got your boobs. You got your boobs. Yeah. Mm -mm -mm. What's the veteran? Is veteran in here? What you mean veteran, my brother? You know veteran's not my note. That ain't my note. Mm -mm. But you know what? Veteran can sometimes smell like the note I like. Could you mention it? You said veteran in here, right? Right, right, right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. On the dry down, when this dry is down, you can smell the vetiver. But it doesn't smell like it doesn't smell like that rooty vetiver. It smells like something else to me. It smells like a, a really familiar note to me when it dries down. But yes, it is, man. It is. You saw me when I bundle sprayed this when I was up at Rogers. And FJ was like, what you bundle spray? What you just bundle spray? And I went on, I showed him. He was like, then he called. He was like, yo, yo, yo. But he changed his mind because I guess he probably had some on his mind. But he called Rod in that joint. As soon as he saw me bundle spray, he was like, yo. I was like, who there on the phone? Rod was like, FJ. <laughs> All right, fuck. All right, here we go. Number eight. Number eight. Oh, I got to say it because I haven't worn it in a while. And I can't wait to get this, but Cure Valores. You see how much I have left? Cure Valores. Cure Valores. If you want really, really good leather suede, now I bought this from Mid New York a long time ago. She went up, when I bought this, it was, um, have a separate Cure Valores? <laughs> yeah, man. You haven't sprayed it? I bought this probably about five years ago. I've had this for five years. I refuse to spray it until I buy it. When I bought this, it was $150. Another one where as I was walking out the door and Christian was like, yo, try this right here, try this right here. Every time I'm walking out the door, Christian was like, come back, you might want to try this. I tried Cure Valores. And I, in fact, you might see my video. You might see the video. It was about five years ago. I was in Mid-New York. Man, put it in the bag. Just put it in the bag. I only got... Where is it? Put it in the bag. This is so... Cure Ottoman is really good, too. My Parfums, The Empire, that's good, too. But this right here, man, one of the best ways I ever smelled in my life, man. One of the best ways I ever smelled in my life. And I got a feeling I'm not going to get this before I get the other juice I was looking at, which I'm kind of falling off the other juice. My man, uh, C-Money turned me on the Papillon Bengali Rouge. You know? I don't even have Cure Ottoman, man. I got to get that, bro. But I want to make sure I got the original. If you got the new bottle, you probably got the reformulation. Because they got a new bottle. Perfume the Empire got a new bottle. I'm going to get the old bottle just to be sure. You know what I mean? But it might be the same. It might be the same. Who knows? That's right. But yeah, man. Cure Valores. You got to have it. It's like 175 now. It might be up to 195. Because she only make a certain batch all year. And her name is, um, what's her name? What's the young lady name? I forgot her name. She only makes a certain batch per year. 
And that's all she make. She don't make, she ain't making 1,000 bottles a year. She might make like 200 bottles a year and that's it. You know what I mean? Bada bing. Well, I want to cut back on the wine. Naomi good sir. thank you very much. Thank you guys, see, that's what I'm talking about. I'm glad I have a knowledgeable crowd here. Yeah, yeah, I've always drank beers. I always drink beers, but I only drink craft beers. Now, if I drink a beer, it's gonna be craft beer. I don't drink freaking Heineken's and, and Yingling's and all that stuff, not unless ain't nothing in the, in the place I'm at. Other than that, only drink stout beers and porters is what I like best when I'm drinking beer. But I, I have to stick away from the wine. You can't drink too much wine. Wine will raise your cholesterol. Believe me, I'm telling you. Cause when I cut back on the wine, my cholesterol went down. I was drinking wine like it was water. And it isn't worth you can drink wine, by the way, destroy it. So anyway, I was drinking wine like it was water. You know what I mean? And my cholesterol zoomed up. But as soon as I cut down on the wine, my cholesterol was like 240, something like that. My cholesterol is now back down to 195 because I cut out the wine. So, yeah. Some people can drink wine all day and not care about their cholesterol, I do. So now I'm doing a little bit more. I'm doing a little bit of both. I do a little bit of wine. I do a little bit of stouts and porters. All right. Number seven. Number seven. Number seven. There's got to be. And y'all gonna be saying, yo, number seven is that? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Number seven. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Vio Volta. Vio Volta. You know what I mean? Vio Volta, man. I let this young lady smell Vio Volta. I thought she was going to say, that's revolting. You know what I mean? Vio Volta is revolting. Man, she smells, she's like, let me smell. Oh, that smells good. That was on the dry down. This thing dries down to a nice incense. And as you know, I like incense fragrances. Yo, this bad boy right here, it dries down so beautifully. Like Earth, Wind, and Fire says, don't you agree? Oh, man. And even the front, the top, like Twinkle Toes, she want, Twinkle Toes want to do a, a video with me. I don't know what that, let's do a video together. I don't know if I want to do a, a video with Twinkle Toes. I don't know, I got to see. Anyway, she didn't like this. She was like, ah, I didn't like it, I don't like it. And all of a sudden she said she liked it when it dried down. Because that's what Vio Volta is about. It smells like electricity until it dries down. It gets beautiful. You know what I mean? Yeah, I might do a video with Twinkle Toes. She wanna come over here Tuesday and sniff in the cage. She came over one night, she only got through one cage. You know what I mean? Like I said, one cage got about 125 fragrances in it. I think I'm up to about almost 370 fragrances. I'm gonna count them one day. But anyway, yes indeed. Buy your Volta, man. Buy it. If you want to smell different, if you're trying to be a crowd pleaser, or you want to get a mainstream niche that anybody got, then buy one of the mainstream niches. Oh yeah, man, yeah. She bought a couple bottles. In fact, she bought uh, she bought two bottles. She bought two bottles that Notorious Sue, yeah, I even smell it yet. Cause I don't think they do Oud. I don't think, I don't think Oud is the D.S. Durkin's game. They game is wood, they in the woods. But, you know, hey, Notorious Real Peanutty? Oh, why did they have that then? Cause I like Peanutty, man. I like Peanutty. I'm about to spell that Notorious Ooh there, cause I like peanuts. Via Volta. Number six. Another one. If you can find it, you can find it. If you can't find it, you can't find it. Drive Van Notten. And if I had Drive Van Notten, that would be in my top 10. Drive Van Notten and Oud X-Tray. The both of them smell the same to me. Oud X-Tray smells like Drive Van Notten to me. And Drive Van Notten and Oud X-Tray kind of smells like, what? What, smell like what to me? Drive Van Notten is that juice. That's that, I can't afford it. I'll come out and tell you I can't afford it. I ain't, I ain't rich. But drive by nothing and what's called and ooh, it smells like what's called to me. It smells like uh, um Palo Santo. Kind of smells like Palo Santo to me. You know what I'm saying? But those little masks kind of smell peanuts in there. You know what I mean? You found a hundred. Yeah, I ain't no, I ain't spending much. I ain't, I ain't no, it's too much. It's too much. Richwood is good too. I like sandalwood. I like mice or sandalwood. Y'all ready? 
Number seven. Can't arrive. Can't arrive. Spanish fly, caviar, and vanilla. And no, we cannot smell this. And no, we cannot spray this. Because, yeah, yeah, yeah. Spanish fly, caviar, and vanilla. That means if you spray this on, the lady gonna go crazy. That Spanish fly, back in the day, you know what I mean? I'm an old head, I'm 58. Spanish fly used to be that dip. Absolutely, bro. You can find it overseas. It's gonna cost you a little bit to get it there. Picato, Picato, uh, 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 what is it called? Picato Originale. They got another one called, they got like four or five. But definitely this right here is my favorite. I think the other one's called Morphine. They got one called Morphine too. But Can Ride, another one. Men New York. Men New York turned me on to this. And if you look at my videos back in the day, you'll see me talking about this, paying for it with my cash money when I bought this in Men New York. And Rose got mad, Rose OA got mad when I put it on his page talking about, we don't want nobody uh, flashing money around buying fragrances. He actually kicked me out of his group back in the day. I'm back in his group now, but I never forget. I never forget. Can I ride? Picato Originale. Number six. Number five. And this is easy. Plum Japonaise. Number five. And y'all know what Plum Japonaise is. One of my favorite plums. One of my favorite plums. And uh, yeah, I mean, he's a cool guy, man. He all right. He does. I was new. I was, I was new in the game. I was just as new as maybe FJ was in the game. And I was buying juices, man. I was flashing money around, whatever. Mugs was hating me, man. They was hating me because I was buying juice and they was trying to keep up. Because they was getting free bottles and I was buying my juice. And they couldn't understand. Dude was telling me, uh, you using your credit card to buy juice? I would never use my credit card to buy juice. They was hating on me hard back then, man. They was hating on me hard. I said, you, you can't use a credit card to buy juice because you don't have a Neiman's card or Nordstrom's card or Bloomingdale's card or Barney's card. You ain't got no card. That's why. Bam, Plum Japonaise, enough said. Must hate when your credit is good. They hate when your credit is good. Think when you're driving around in the lease BMW for the next last 10 years, you can't stand it. How you get the lease a BMW and you got all that stuff, you got all that stuff, you got all that equipment stuff. Cause I pay my bills, that's why. And I can buy whatever I want. I get any credit card I want. Except the black card. I ain't get the black card yet, but I don't want the black card. I would be out of control. Y'all ready? The final four is coming in, coming at you. And that's how I do it. And baby, y'all gonna be surprised. Number four. Another 13. Of course. Number 13. And again... Who is responsible for another 13 coming to the States? Who hyped up number, another 13 so much that they are about to discontinue the doggone store? They was closing down the Colette store. They are about to stop making the fragrance. But they saw Rod's video and the people was buying it like crazy. Thanks to my man A to the Deuce. Sent me a backup bottle. And mugs are going crazy. Women chasing me around the parking lot. I turned people on another 13. We had people hating on another 13. Oh, it's just a must fragrance. What's that guy name in New York? Yeah, it Mitsu US Time. That guy. Uh, it just uh, My man gifted him. A to the deuce gifted the guy. A to the deuce gifted him another 13. And he talked about it like a dog. Uh, it's just another synthetic must. That's okay. Look where it's at now. Thanks to your boy, Rodney Real Deep Cool, taking credit for another 13 being in the States. You can talk to me later about it. What's in it? Women. Women. Yeah, yeah, chis little homie. No, turn that back though. Spell it, spell, spell, spell it Mitsu backwards. It's us time. And Mitsu backwards is us time. Like, I couldn't figure it out. Like, I'm a freaking, some kind of dummy. U.S. time in Mitsu. Come on, cuz, I'm too smart. And when he down another 13 like that, 
I'm like, that's all right, cuz. Here's what I'm Well, man, each his own, you know, that, you know, because you liked it, don't mean anybody else like it. Well, look what happened because I liked it. No 13s in the States. Thank you. You're welcome. Next. I know what my influence is to the game. I know people don't like me. I know I'm a polarizing guy. Cause y'all go talk to him like, I saw a Rod video. And them guys will say to you, oh, I ain't even look at that guy, man. I can't believe you even look at that guy. Cause I'm polarizing. I'm gonna split you down the middle. I'm gonna make you take sides. That's my job is to make you take sides. If I got you liking me like you like everybody else, then I'm just part of that crowd. Y'all know, be a leader, not a follower. Separate yourself from the rest. Stay away from the foolishness. That's, how I, that's my credo. I separate myself from the rest. I want you to do the same. And don't be scared when somebody say, uh, you shouldn't be looking at Raj. Tell them what you got to tell them. Take some of that. Take some of that right there. Separate yourself from the rest. Be a leader, not a follower. Stay away from the foolishness and keep it heavenly. That's what we do. Amber Absolute. Nope, you're not going to be able to find it. This is the original bottle, original flat sticker label, not the raised label. Bada bing, bada boom, how your boy 100 bars? Amber Absolute. If you don't have Absolute in your collection, I must say, you don't have a collection. You don't have a collection. You got to step it up. Step it up. So FJ, I know you got this. If not, brother, you're not quite there yet. You're not quite there yet. But you're getting there. I like that you're getting there. Cause you just like me, when e Dot was helping me get there. I wanna help you get there. I wanna help Ava get there. I wanna help all the people who try to do it the special way get there. Get it, Amber Absolute. And get the original. Get the one with the flat label, not the one with the raised label. You have the reformulated one. And you can't find that one anywhere, and if you do, it's gonna cost you $435. $435. One of the best Ambers out there, one of the best Ambers ever formulated. Insist and Amber. Buy it. Number three. And y'all cats gonna be like, no, frick, I'm sorry. Number two, number two. And I'm down to these two. And y'all gonna be like, ain't no way he's down to these number two. This guy is whacked out. He been drinking too many freaking stout horses. Out of all these fantastic fragrances, how in the world did you pick these last two? How, Roger? You go, I might just discredit my channel. I might just discredit this whole video when I break out these two of y'all. I might discredit the whole video. Y'all like, nah, ain't no way, man. This guy's a freaking joke. This guy's a clown. All them fragrances out there, and he picked these last two? <laughs> yeah, because I'm not a mainstream dude. I don't, I don't cater. I don't cater to the mainstream. I don't cater to the Illuminati, Frag Illuminati. Just like this track. Oh, this guy done blew my cover. How you know I had Nautica? Oh, man, I knew that was going to happen, dog. I knew somebody was going to blow my cover. Somebody knew me better than I knew me. Yep, Nautica. Here it is. The butter. The butter. The butter. John Bieber, you done created one of those, baby. You done created one, baby. You done created one, baby. No, never. Colin Kaepernick, baby. The Kaepernick. The buttery smooth sandalwood that when you lay it on your skin, it's like opening up your refrigerator, right? And I don't know, y'all eat meat. So say for whatever your favorite meat is. Slather some butter on that favorite meat of yours and slather it on your skin. The Colin Kaepernick. Sopanika. Oh! Stop it, please. I can't believe this guy even made this. And if you ever see, if you ever see, if you ever see his name is John Bieber, 
Yeah, John Bieber. If you look at me, look at John Bieber. He was there. He had a suit on with some sneakers. A regular guy, bald head, Caucasian guy. Look at look at John Bieber and think that this guy made this. Think that he made this. You would think he would have never made this. Smoke the rolls, yeah, because I can't stand smoke the rolls. Twinkle toes, boys. Well, I bought I bought smoke the rolls for Twinkle toes. But look here, man. You just dropped a new one. Yeah. He's welcome. He's welcome, because I'm the only one talking about the Kaepernick. The Colin Kaepernick, baby. The butter sauce. The buttery sandalwood with the sweetness that just makes the ladies go crazy. You need to try it. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. No. Uh-uh. Bro. Listen. 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 Tinder. I need to listen to me, bro. Theodore. You don't need to try it. If it's my number two, buy it. Let me try it. Just buy it. Get your $160 together, call a perfumology, and just buy it. It's my number two, bro. I got 375 fragrances in my cage. This made it to number two. Buy it. Period. No, I'm just kidding. If you like sandalwood, I'm a sandalwood guy. I'm a sandalwood guy. I like 1996 too. In fact, 1996 was almost my signature scent. I bought 1996 when they hit the market too. I was there waiting for that joint of Neiman's. I was waiting for the package to come down for 1996. But, and that was gonna be my, in fact, if you look at my video, you'll see that I had 1996 as my signature scent. That's right. But, Maybe 150 bottles later, man, things will happen. Things happen. 150 bottles later, things happen. Like this right here. The Colin Kaepernick, the Sopanica. And that's why, this is why John Bieber would never send me a bottle for free. Because of how controversial Colin Kaepernick is. And that is fine with me. Because I don't mind Colin Kaepernick. Michael Alshon was my number one. That would not be quite there, uh, Christian, because I don't have it. Okay, now, last but not least, my number one. I'm gonna give you guys time to figure out the number one. And I'll give you a hint. I have not too long ago just got this number one. I have not just too long ago got this. And this is my number one. So, I'm gonna give y'all a chance. In fact, I'm gonna step out. I'm, I'm not gonna step out. I'm gonna watch y'all video. I'm gonna watch what y'all got to say. And whoever pick out my number one, I'm gonna send you a five mil of it. Totally free. Shipping's on me. So, get the guessing. While well, I listen to my new track. Guess what my number one is? <laughs> Right on. Bye, right. 32 of y'all here. Come on now. Might be. The green by right. No, not by right. I never had this many people in my live before, man. I guess I do gotta do countdowns. Y'all really like countdowns. <laughs> You know, I had like five people here and three lights. But look here, man. I just want to entertain y'all. Let y'all hear some of my music. Or gold juice. Nope. Anybody else want to jump in? I'm giving five mil away for free. And if you guys been keeping up with me, well, I already showed you that one. So it can't be number one. Nope. Speaking of portrait of a lady, if you want portrait of a lady and don't want to spend that kind of money, then basically just buy Amwaj Epic Woman. Smokes put your lady all day long. Same ingredients, but don't have the clothes. I give y'all to the song is over. When the song is over, I'll crack it. One of my favorite songs. I know I can't get to the clothes, man. I already did use memory, so it can't be number one. Pardon the neck nibbler. Nah, not rehab. 
Nope. Number one in my cage. I went crazy. Nope. Nope. You got time. You know what I want to get? I want to get Tuscan scent acacia, man. I mean, I like, I like, I like the incense, but number two, <clears throat> Sulpanica. S U S E L S E L. Now scroll down. And the winner is Stir Bahan. Uh, do I pronounce your name right, bro? Do I pronounce your name right? Stir? Is it Stir? By him? Stir by him? Stir by him. And y'all look and see what he said, and y'all know. Y'all better see what his lie said. I'm about to pop it out. Oh, my goodness. Are you kidding me? Are you freaking kidding me? These guys must have been smoking weed. These freaking guys must have been, they must have been like smoking weed, sniffing coke, drinking barbiturates. Ain't no clue. They, they already guessed it. Stir hand gets the five mil. Stir. Stir. Um, I somehow got to get in contact with you, bro, so I can send this to you. So hit me up. I'll put it down. I'll put it down in a live video when I'm done. And I'll give you my email address. And you can hit me up. Anybody can hit me up on my email address, okay? El Cosmico. Oh my goodness. I can wear this every day. I can wear this and the butter every day. Yo, I can wear these two. I can wear these two every day and be happy with life as life lives. If I had to keep two out of all of these, out of the Grammy juice, out of Kalamot, out of, out of Youth Memories, out of the Cherry Sauce, out of Amber Absolute, I can wear these bad boys every freaking day of the week. I'm gonna get me another bottle of this. As soon as it wears out, I'm getting another bottle. And as soon as this is gone, I'm getting 100 mil. In fact, I already called to him. You got a funny jam. This jam, FTJ be playing me, man. He be playing me, dog. He going back to the videos way back, man. <laughs> Stop playing me. I'm giving me 100 mil of this. I'm getting me 100 mil of El Cosmico. I already called Raj. Now, here I was gonna do. I'm gonna sell this. <laughs> Yeah, your address. You in the Philippines, bro? Really? Well, you didn't guess it right, so you don't get the five mil, bro. But anyway, it's good knowing your address. Stir is the first one that got it. I'm sorry, bro. Stir got the first guess, man. Stir was the first one that got it. Well, go to Aqua. I mean, but I work something out that we can do something else. I'm a Philippine guy, man. I've been to the Philippines six times. And you know where I went to the Philippines at? I went to a longer pole, Subic Bay, baby. Subic Bay, a longer pole city. Woo! What? Philippines, baby. Philippines, me, baby. And as the ladies, as the ladies used to say, stir is Newberry in your streams. He don't deserve it. I'm sorry, man. He's the first one guessed it. And I don't know how he guessed it, because I don't even see him that often. But there goes the show, he pays attention. He pays attention. I ain't trying to say y'all don't pay attention, but he pays attention. He's the first one got it. But yeah, my man in the Philippines, the women used to say to me, Mahakita. Mahakita. I know what Mahakita mean. That's right. I really enjoyed the Philippines, man. For the Philippines six times. Yes, indeed. He don't deserve it. Yes, he does, man. He's the first one to guess it. He's the first one to get it. I love you. Yep. Females, I used to get off the boat, man. I was in the Navy. And every time we went we went out on the cruise, we had to stop in the Philippines. And then we go out on the cruise. When we come back, we had to stop in the Philippines again. 
to come back to the States. So yeah, I went to the Philippines six times, had me a beautiful girlfriend after the second cruise, had me a beautiful girlfriend. When I got there, man, she was waiting for me. But let's just get back to the juice. The dry down on El Cosmico is magical. Magical. It is totally magical. This is, yo, like, with, look, look. I like dry downs. I like transitions, man. The, the best transition fragrance I ever smelled was by Zoologist. What's going on, Bryce? Yeah, yeah, I was on the, I was on the USS Constellation, man, Westpac. So every time we went out to a Westpac, we went to a cruise. We go to the Indian Ocean every time we go on a cruise. Are you a corpsman? Okay, okay, cool, cool. I was an aviation electrician's mate. <coughs> but um, I worked on them jets, man. I worked on them A7Es. I worked on them A7Es, baby. Them attack, them attack jets. Yeah, but look here. The dry down on Els Cosmico. And I'm gonna give credit where credit's due. If it wasn't for ASOL, if it wasn't for ASOL, I would not have bought El Cosmico. ASOL and, and Paul McGowan. Due to either one, one of the two bought, because I think Paul bought El Cosmico too. Between ASOL and El Cosmico, so that juice. I ain't trying to say it'll smoke Cuban Lures. It's some Cuban Lures is a suede. You smell it, you know it's a suede. That's my point. With this, when you smell it, you don't have no idea what it is. You don't know what it is. Oh, you know, it's just like it's just like another 13. When you spray another 13, I mean some people consist the musk. You can automatically pick out the musk. Automatically for the most part. But when you smell Cuban Lures, you're smelling suede. There's no doubt you smell a suede. You know you smell a leather. When you, that's the kind of juice I like. When I spray it and I smell it, I don't automatically, I can't identify, I can't identify what's in it. I can't even be close. I'm like, that ain't even close to what I was thinking was in it. That's the kind of juice I like. When I smell Escamico, I didn't even look up the notes when I bought this. I'm like, this and Vol VI Volta? Put them in the bag. I don't care what the notes are. Put them in the bag. Actually, I did look at the VI Volta notes because I had been up there the week before, no, the month before, and I was gonna buy this. No, two weeks before. And I knew I was coming back for this. But man, when you smell Askeem, when you smell this, when you first spray it on your skin, you're like, what the freaking heck is this? I mean, you don't even know what it smells like. It's like, I don't know what this smells like. And I, it's like I smell banana. I smell some kind of fruit. I smell that. Now, let me tell you what it kind of smells like. If you have Mojave Ghost by Byredo, I said that. It kind of smells like Mojave Ghost, but it does not have the magical dry down as Mojave Ghost. So if you're gonna, if you switch between Mojave Ghost, cause these both are supposed to indicate the desert. Look up the notes. Look up the notes of Mojave Ghost, which they had that Sapio Sapa, of uh, Sapio Sapa fruit. This is based all on desert cactuses and stuff like that. Yo. 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 If you don't want to smell like anybody else on the planet tomorrow, which I will not, nobody's wearing this except me and Paul McGowan. And Paul, Paul knows that. Paul like, oh snap. Yo, we might be wearing this together. Yo, if they like Mojave Ghost, they're gonna really like, cause I don't love fragrances. They're gonna really like El Cosmico. Not because my coffee ghost is a linear fragrance. I, I smell my hobby ghost. I had it on my skin. It didn't do nothing. It pretty much stayed the same. It stayed sweet. It had its little wood tones in it. And it did what it did. This bad boy dries down to the prettiest incense you ever want to smell. It's like, it's like this woody sweet incense. And I like incense. And I said that earlier in the video, how much I like this particular note. I like incense. I like frankincense. I like that sense. And the two I got coming in from Corner Barcelona, woo! What you mean buy this for them? Man, you gotta buy this for yourself, man. And buy 100 mil. Cause what I'm gonna do is, this is now for sale. 
This costs $175. 175. I will sell this to you today, tonight only, for $110. Well, Raj, if that's your favorite fragrance, then why would you sell it? This is your number one UK. Why would you sell it? $110. You get the box and everything. I'll box it up and send it to you. All right? You know why? Because I'm getting 100. I already called them. I already called them. Raj, 100. I need 100. I need 100. And if you don't give me 100, I'm just going to buy another. I'm going to buy another 50. I'm going to buy another 50. In fact, don't worry about it. I'm going to keep it. I want two bottles. I want two separate bottles. Don't worry. I changed my mind. Changed my mind. Because 100 ml of this is $245. I'm just going to buy another 50. I'm going to buy another 50. So forget about that. Because y'all ain't reacting fast enough. No, forget it. Just buy your own. But call Roger and buy it. Roger will give you a decent price. He'll give you a really good price. He won't charge you retail. Just tell him your boy. Raj called from Philly, called Perfumes Outlet at Rockville Mall, and told him Raj said, you want the Els Cosmico. If I have it, and if Paul McGowan have it, and Paul McGowan got all the juice. Did somebody say some of your cure lures? What? Never. I'm going to keep that little bit of juice, my little 10 mil I got in there, forever. The way you feel about cowboy grass, might grab a 100. I feel you, man. Cowboy grass is okay. It's a green piece, but I already had green pieces. I already had grassy pieces. So I don't need more grass pieces. But, yo, I'm going to buy another bottle. It's better for me to buy another bottle. They ain't got to worry about buying 100 mil. But then again, if you catch me tomorrow, just put it down in the comments below. Remember, I need you guys to comment below. I know y'all talking here. Just remember what you said here and in the comments below. Put it down so it's like we had a good time tonight. It's like we had a really good time. We was talking, man. Do me that favor. Before y'all get offline tonight with me doing this live, write down what you said tonight in the comments. Not everything you said, but at least something you said. Yeah, I don't really like cowboy grass that much. I definitely don't like it more than this. I would have it. Oh, Cosmico. I got, I got... I got Colin Kaepernick on my neck. I'm ready to go out, make him run. To summarize, and to summarize, I don't need to count down nothing but the last two. Sobonica by January Sim Project, John Bieber. El Cosmico by D.S. and Durger. I forgot their names. Only two I need. Not for life. I'm not stupid like that. Two for life. No, we're not doing that. How long does it last? Forever. Forever. I mean, if you spray them like a, if you spray them like light in the shorts, though, I don't know. I don't spray light in the shorts. But I say I put four sprays on my hand, and I was washing my hand throughout the day. I wore it to work. I still smelled it. I still smell the dry down. Oh, man. I'm... Oh. Let's spray soap and on top of it and see what happens. Let's see what it tastes like. Let's see what it smells like. Because <clears throat> they slow. They don't know. But that's okay. That's okay. That smells weird. <laughs> I just combine them two together. Yeah, don't, don't, don't do that. Don't, don't, don't do that. I've had soap and Nika for probably about six months now. And as soon as I'm out of it, I'm buying it again. It's not the best sandalwood I've ever smelled in my life. No. I mean, I would say that, uh, I would say Serge do tens if you can find it. Mice or sandalwood because that's true Mysore sandalwood. I never smell Richwood, so I don't know about that. And I do have a Mysore sandalwood called Smuggler's Soul by Gorilla Perfumes slash Lush. I had Smuggler's Soul, but it smells nothing like this. Creamy, 
butter. Do you like butter? I mean, I can't eat butter because I'm a vegan. So I don't eat anything that comes from a cow and all that stuff. And don't think because they got a cow on here, I mean I'm drinking cow milk. I'm just saying. I can't eat anything that's buttery. I can't do it. But if you like butter and sandalwood, and anybody knows sandalwood smells like butter, this is the best. Now, I'm not trying to get a bottle. In fact, if he sent me a bottle, I would just give somebody this bottle, if he was. But because I'm so polarizing, I can't represent all the fragrances that I like because they know I'm a polarizing guy. I might do this all night and talk about their fragrances, and tomorrow night, I'll be talking about how much I like Trump. Look at y'all, y'all tripping. I ain't gonna say I like Trump, but I ain't got no problem with Trump. Like I said, man, I still got my job, I'm still in the union, man. I don't care what that boy do, whatever. Uh, Mysore Sandalwood, yes, sir. That's an endangered product. You just can't get Mysore Sandalwood anymore. You can't walk in the store and say, give me some Mysore Sandalwood. No, you can't do that. It's an endangered item right now. And if you bought Mysore Sandalwood, it will probably cost more than some of the ooze that you would buy easily, okay? So thank y'all for sitting through this. Thank y'all for checking out my new tracks from the 2020 CD. Hope y'all get to check it out. Hopefully we get to win this CD in 2021. I mean, win this Grammy in 2021. In the meantime, man, I'm just happy to see you guys, okay? Thank y'all so very much for sticking around, man. I ain't know I'd get this much love, man. It's kind of, only time I got like 30 or more frames, I mean, 30 or more people online is why I was talking about boxing. I was talking about the Earl Spence fight. Other than that, I've never had 30 people and 28 likes, man. So, thank you guys so very much, man. I almost want to cry over here, man. Because I try my best to do the best I can, man. I know I'm a polarizing dude. I know everybody ain't going to like me, man. I want to I express to get 20,000 subscribers and stuff like that, man. But I'd rather keep my integrity, man, than to give myself up to sell myself out, man. I just can't do it, bro. I can't do it, y'all. I can't do it, sisters. I can't do it. I got to be me. I got to be me. That's all I can be. Only thing I'm good at is being me. I ain't good at being somebody else. Oh, man, you done missed the whole thing, I try. I'm all done, brother. We've been here for an hour. But uh, check out the video. Replay it. Check out. And please, please, y'all, check out... Um, Italian Cypress? Yeah, I'm not really... I don't, Radio Bombay is pretty good, not 13. You know what I like, though? Cypress Shade. By House of Wood, the egg, Cypress Shade. Had no cypress in it, but it's really, really good. Don't forget, stir. Put your name down, or hit me up on Facebook. Whatever you gotta do to get in contact with me, so I can see you just five mil of El Cosmico. Okay? Thank you all for listening. Sorry, Lil. Sorry you late, my bro. I'm out. I'm ready to bounce. I'm ready to go to... Iron Hill Brewery finished watching the uh, the game and uh, try out some more beers there. They got a lot of beers there. Okay. Give him one more surprise, Raj. Okay. I'll give him another one. I'll give him another one. I'm probably give him Vio Volta. In fact, no. I'll give him my top two. So, Stir, because you got this right, bro, I'll give you these two five mils. I'll give you five mil of this. I'll give you five mil of this. Make sure I get your address. Somehow contact me. My email address. Write it down. My email address. I really don't use my website address. I mean, my website address is roger at hollowmedia.com. I rarely use that because I rarely go over there. I got a website I don't even pay attention to. I ain't going to lie, y'all. I don't really go over there and check that website out. I mean, but it is a resource for y'all. It's like my business card for people. But my email address is p as in Paul, R O. The number two, S E R, that's producer, pro, deuce, two, sir, S E R, producer at AOL.com. Hit me up, my bro. Any of y'all can hit me up. A lot of people hit me up when I'm doing decants and stuff. People know my email address, but all y'all can know my email address because I'm a businessman, so y'all know my email address. So if you want any of the music that I'm, I'm playing tonight, any of my music, I can burn it, I can make an MP3 for you and zoom it right over to you. All I gotta do is put the money in my cash app, give me 99 cents, I'll give you any song you want that you like, all right? But bada bing, bada boom, El Cosmico, the number one fragrance in my collection. Why, Raj? Because when I spray it, I have no idea what the heck I'm smelling. But when it finishes, it smells awesome.
time. Thank you, sir. I appreciate that. I really appreciate trust, man. I really do appreciate your trust. All right? I'm out, y'all. Talk to y'all later. Y'all know what it is. Again, be a leader, not a follower. Stay away from the foolishness. Separate yourself from the rest and keep it heavenly. Separate yourself means your fragrances. Try not to smell like anybody on any particular day in the universe. And then you know you're there. How's y'all soon, man? Thank y'all. Let me know the next video y'all want me to do. I'll do it, man. If y'all want me to do the top 10 something, just let me know. But you got to put it down in the comments below. So all y'all, put your comments down below. What's the next video you want me to do? Top 10 this, top 20 that, whatever, man. I'll do it, man. I'll do it. I'll do it. I'll do it tomorrow night after I get off work. All right? Talk to y'all later. Be well, man. To you, your family, your friends, man. Stay well. The skankiest, I don't own many of those, man, so they're not going to work. But put down your suggestions anyway down in the comment section below. And the one that I can accommodate and really get down with, I'll definitely, definitely do it, all right? Talk to y'all later, man. Be well. Sleep in peace. Relax. Do your thing. And spray something before you go to bed, baby. Spray something before you go to bed. So you wake up in the middle of the night like, ooh, ooh, ooh. Yeah. Hello. Thank you, DJ. Talk to y'all soon, man. Happy Wilson. I'll see y'all. I can probably do the top 10 who's. That's right. I can probably do that. All right. I'm out. Later. Bars for stars. <laughs>